I just got the insane opportunity to fly this aircraft in a massive music video with J Balvin and Skrillex. Apparently, I live under a rock because when I asked my friends who these people are, they said, so I immediately said yes, but then reality hit. But it's broken! Oh yeah, Ross Smith just threw a basketball at me while I was flying. And to make things worse, I live in Los Angeles and this video is all the way in New York City in 10 days. You're about to watch the hardest experience of my entire life and ultimately the beginning of how I flew in the new Spider-Man movie. Are you the Green Goblin from Spider-Man? The pigeons were like, who is that? How are you, mate? Spider-Man. Our trip to Spain is doing so well. So well. Crazy. It was so well. Terrible experience. It was unbelievably uncomfortable. 3.30 a.m. right now, and I cannot go to sleep yet. As soon as this 3D printer finishes running, I have to immediately start the next part. Each one takes 10 hours. We barely have enough time to get through them all. After five days of non-stop work, I'm not even close, and tomorrow is my last chance to ship the board to New York City on time. So it's 4 a.m. Technically, we're supposed to be shipping tomorrow, and this thing looks bad. <sighs> okay. It looks like it's now or never. I'm going to have to ship all of my tools, half of an aircraft, and finish working on it in New York City. Well, I thought I was shipping. Yeah, I just drove an hour to meet up with the shipping guy. We're gonna put the aircraft on a plane. He calls me and says, oh, well, it turns out the plane isn't available anymore. I mean, it's not available anymore. The drone can no longer be shipped and I am out of options. So I texted Jay Balvin. His response was drive. We're getting to the point where I guess I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, drive there myself. The record label said find a car ASAP. Unfortunately, we needed the biggest one, AKA the most expensive. I packed all night and had no idea this is what I was getting myself into. Guys, future Hunter here. I just showed Liz the video. I don't understand why you would fly with a broken motor. You could have died. Well, we had a parachute on set. You're not even going to deploy by the time you hit the ground. Bro. Exactly. <laughs> I don't know why we had one. That's some serious dedication. Make sure to subscribe. It's crazy. Oh, we made it. We're on the road. I'm eating a pizza at 5 a.m. This guy's sleeping. He's going to take over in a little bit. One day, 17 hours. What does that even mean? <laughs> We're in Colorado, guys. We're on the side of the road with our massive cars. I'm about to set up my office here. I'll be back here working. He's gonna be up there driving. It's gonna be intense, but here we go. At the speed we're driving, I realized if I don't start working now, the Skysurfer aircraft will not be finished on time. How long were you just driving for? Eight hours. I was back there working on that thing for eight hours? That is insane. Jay Baldwin just called saying the whole production's relying on me, so now I'm really nervous. This thing is suspended in the back of the car. I've been working on it non-stop. Angel's been driving. Uh, we're headed to New York City. How many hours away are we? 20. After building for the next 16 hours, I finally finished a brand new Skysurfer aircraft. I was so excited to stop for a quick test flight. All right, guys, we potentially have problems. We're out here in the middle of nowhere. He's pulling the car around to shine lights on me because we've got the hoverboard out on the ground. I wanted to run a quick test on it and do some motor calibrations because I will not have the chance to do it tomorrow before the music video shoot. Having some problems, though, with communications. It is not working properly. It is freezing out here. Hopefully, we can figure this thing out. Right now, we're looking at 2 a.m. to get into New York City. That is insane. I kind of look like a monster right now, too. Okay, I found the problem. Can you guess what it is? Mm, no. <laughs> approximately 10 18 approximately really late still four and a half hours away from New York so this is intense something happened during this past few days whenever we were doing these all-night working sessions to where these motors got crosswired so I can't very well like rip this entire thing apart right now to figure out like what's going on with that we're gonna have to throw it back into the car and keep on chucking down the road so let's do it <laughs> all right so we can figure out what's going on with this in the next four hours I'll be back we finally arrived, but the music video is today. Dude, this is, I, I honestly can't believe you guys did that. That's like the craziest drive. Dude, I was just back here working this whole Don't time. Like, I paid for my friend Kaz to fly here and help document the experience because I couldn't convince him to drive with us. So first thing, I shoved him in the back. Now you know how it feels. Imagine that for like dude, I would have 36 been, hours. We brought a mattress, dude. We need to cause a huge scene in Times Square. No, so it turns out that happened, but we'll get to it later. Like That's what I was thinking too. Dude, I'm so stoked. I just feel like I should fly this thing tonight though. Let's do it right now. Make sure it actually works. Heck yeah. This is the first test on the new generation of the hoverboard. All right, are you ready to try this thing out? The new and improved drone? This is exciting, dude, actually. This is like two weeks of work right here, so we'll see how it goes. I can't crash. I literally have no backups of anything. It's either we do it now or in front of Jay, so. Why not try it in New York City? This new Sky Surfer has a couple secrets built in that I've spent the past six months researching. It's now 20% more powerful and it feels amazing to fly. Oh. 
This is private property, but the hotel gave us permission to fly on the outside. We did all the wake up everybody on the inside. What? Right, go, 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 go. Bro, we gotta go. Let's get it. Yo, yo, yo. <laughs> we have to be on set in about eight hours, but now I have to recharge the aircraft's batteries. Back to the hotel to get a couple hours of sleep. I've got to bring the Sky Surfer upstairs. Girly face. <laughs> After all that work, we just slammed into the wall and cracked a motor, and I have no spare parts, so a propeller could easily fall off while I'm flying, and I don't know what to do. Four hours later, we hauled it back down to the car and are finally on the way to the set of this music video. We were told this was going to be a practice day, but when we got there, they said, No, today's the last day. We have to get it done. Wait, seriously? This place is wild right now. I'm getting ready for a test flight. The cracked arm is causing some serious problems when I take off. Here it happens again, and the more I fly, it's only going to get worse, so stick around till the music video. This is super risky, and the only reason I'm flying today is to create content for you guys. So before I take this really sketchy landing, I want to say I appreciate all of you guys hitting the subscribe button, and thank you so much for following the journey. Okay, this is a weird situation. I'm trying to turn left and land, and it's just not working. I can't line myself up. Okay, so whatever. I'm just gonna let it freely spin right, because that's the way it just wants to go. Oh, nope. Okay, now I'm unstable. I'm spinning out of control. I can't stop. I can't do anything. I'm gonna hit a sandbag. So I guess forget this. I'm gonna go over here to the clean spot, try and land. I'm just gonna grind up all of this dirt, these rocks, and this is costing me a lot of money here. Maybe eventually I'll be able to land. I haven't told anybody why, but that test flight was terrible, so comment down below what you guys would do in this situation. I have a stunt coordinator, and he can tell something's wrong. He's been standing on the sidelines in a crash pad. Guys, please, back up right behind me. It's just like staying back like, I don't know. He also has a parachute, which is hilarious, because that would literally never work. It feels like he's pulling right a little for some reason. Really? I'm cranking it to the left pretty hard. I can never find outlets strong enough to charge the aircraft, and when these batteries get too low, they become unstable and burn. Literally. Once again, I'm out of time and it's now or never. Shoot the video, party in the ghetto. Do you say, bro, fly. Do you know what you're doing? On the next one, I'm going up. For what I'm doing, no, not totally. <laughs> Here we go. Stand by, I'll let you know when. Let's roll, play that please. Ready. I'm mind blowing, bro. I thought it was called video effect, you know? Are you for real? You are real? Fly, boy. Let's go. Oh, yeah. You're probably exhausted from shooting all day, right? <laughs> all right, Jay, catch you later. Take care, my G.